Thanks for going Metro. Please be considerate of those around you, and don't play loud music or take up more than one seat. If you're standing, please keep doorways clear by moving to the center of the car. Bikes should be placed in the designated area. So what did you do last night? I took Charlie to a room to this punk concert, and then we went back to my house and we watched Scream 2. That's one with Luke Wilson in it, right? Yeah. Mm. My mom used to go to acting school with him. Really? I didn't know your mom was an actor. She wasn't. She was a real estate agent. How have we been hanging out for like a month and you didn't tell me this? I don't really talk about my mom. She left my dad and I when I was like six. Actually? Yeah, why would I lie about something like that? Yeah, I don't know. Sometimes when people drop like really heavy information on me, I just don't know how to respond. Mm. I mean, do you want to talk about it more? No, I don't need sympathy for something that happened when I was six. Yeah. Listen, Sam, I don't want anything too serious, like nothing I have to commit to. I know. I'm going to Yoon's house. You can't sleep over. Let's go shopping, let's go get our nails done. With the people I actually have a good time with. What do you say after that? Mm, nothing. He ordered me an Uber home though. Does he have a car? Yeah, but I don't want him to think it's serious enough to be driving me around like that. Yeah, fair, fair. Remember when we were younger? We'd be at my grandma's house and we'd go to Blockbusters to get a movie after school. Mm -hmm, the one with the crazy gumball machine. Yeah. <laughs> You'd always take way too long to pick out a movie and then it'd be too late and we'd have to go home. I should probably go. I don't think in our 10 years of friendship your dad has ever let us have a sleepover. Yeah, it's the only thing he really asks of me though. We only ever talk when he tells me to come home. All right, I'll see you tomorrow. are overcome with grief as a teenage boy was murdered and left for dead in a field near his home in Encino. Sam Wilkins was only 17 and was loved by many of his peers.
have you been? I'm fine. Well, it's been like two weeks since I've seen you. There's a small party tonight, and I think it'd be good if you got out the house. Okay. Okay, like you'll come? Yeah, maybe. Okay, good. Love you, Avery. Love you. Because, Yoon, I made out with Sam Wilkins and he was murdered the next day. I made out with those three kids last night and they were murdered this morning. Wait, you made out with those kids last night? That's what you got from this? Can't you see that there's something wrong with me? I mean, yeah. It's weird and it's messed up. But what are you saying? You have some superpower that kills people when they kiss you? <laughs> no, that's not what I'm saying. It's just too crazy to be a coincidence. Like, something like that can't just happen. Avery, life is just one big coincidence. Crazy shit happens all the time. Don't start with that. Can't you just admit that this is insane? People are dead. My head hurts and so does my stomach. You wanna watch something? No, I just want comfort. What are you doing? I don't know, I thought that's what was happening right now. I just told you that the last four people I kissed have died and you kissed me. Are you crazy? Well, we established that was a coincidence. No, I never said that. I told you that I felt crazy and that I thought something was wrong with me. Avery, the whole world doesn't revolve around you. Think about the moms of those boys. They don't care that you kiss their sons. Their sons are gone. That's not what I'm trying to do. I just wanted to tell you that I felt crazy and I just wanted to tell you when you kiss me, what if you die? Avery, I love you. You're acting crazy right now. Everything that's been going on has been crazy. I deserve to feel crazy. I have a right to feel crazy. What if you die, Yoon? I'm not gonna die. Honestly, can you just go? You're scaring me right now. Are you serious? Yeah, just leave. You're getting on my nerves. Fuck you, Yoon. I'm not gonna go. I don't want anything to happen to you. Just go.
no, no, no. Get, get away. No, no, no. Back please. away from the door. I understand you're confused. Okay, but please, please, just listen to me, all right? I, I, I know you're confused. Just, just, just give me a, a second you to explain. You killed those boys. Please, please. Just let me explain. I know that if oh you give me a second... Oh, my God. You're explain. sick. This is sick. What the... Oh, my God. Move away or I'll kill you. I... I killed those boys because I love you. You love me? This is the most we've spoken in months. What do you mean, love me? This isn't love. I didn't want you to leave me. I didn't want you to run off with one of those boys acting like your mother. The only reason I was seeking validation from those boys is because you never give me any. You barely even talk to me. You barely even look at me. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry, Amy. I'm so, so sorry. I just, I just, I just didn't want you to leave me. I need you. Need me? I've always needed you and you never gave me anything. You're right. You're right. I'm sorry. You're right. I'm an idiot. I haven't been there for you. I have no idea how you turned out so incredible. You've always had to do everything on your own. And it's because I'm afraid. And because I don't know how to deal with shit. But I, I, I can be there for you. I can... I can be better. I can take care of you. I can show you love. But